welcome back friends today's video topic is data consolidation tool that is found in the data tab of microsoft excel here you see in the data tab inside data tools there is a consolidate tool so here i am going to show you how to use this tool this data consolidate tool is used for summarizing or aggregating the data for example here i have the sales report for different month in different seats like january february march to june where there is product name and the quantity sold the requirement here is to summarize the sales report here in the top sheet in this table i need to create a consolidated data in this case i can use the data consolidation tool let's start using this tool here first of all click on the first cell of the table then click on data tab then consolidate tool this opens the consolidate dialog box where you have to first choose the function in this case i have to add the sales quantities that is why i need to take the sum function here but if you have to do something other than the sum function then you can choose from the list now in the reference we have to put the range of data that we want to consolidate so click on the reference then go to january month sheet select the data range then click on the add button in this reference section the sheet and range is added now go to the february month sheet then select the data range click on add this will add this range here similarly go to march then click on add go to april select the range click on add click on may select the range then click on add finally click on june month select the range then click on add after adding all the references to be consolidated then here in the use label section we have to select the top row and left column option if you want to create a link of the source data then you can choose this create a link to the source data this is important if you have to automatically change the summary data when you change the data in the source but if your source data is a static data which doesn't change then you don't need to mark this create link to the source data then click on ok here you see the data is consolidated or summarized but the order of the month is changed this is because excel by default sorts the column alphabetically to correct the order of the column insert here a row put the index numbers of the column this should be the first column this is second february should be in the third column march 4 april 5 may 6 and finally june 7 this is the column order now select this range go to the sort tool in the data tab click on options and here short left to right option click on ok in the sort by select this row number two then here in the order we have to take this smallest to the largest order then click on ok this will rearrange the columns now you can delete the helper row and here you see the summarized table is created by using the data consolidation tool so this is how you can use the data consolidation tool to summarize the data if you want to practice this you can download this sample data file from the link given in the video description if you want to learn more in spreadsheets you can go to my channel's video page and watch different video tutorials thank you so much for watching see you again in next tutorial